Hello guys, welcome back to Moto ADV channel. We hope you guys are doing well. Today we gonna show 2024 Honda Super Cup first look review and explain the details of the bike. We hope you guys enjoy it. Please don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Thanks for watching. With over 100 million units sold worldwide since its introduction in 1958, the Honda Super Cub offers a combination of practical simplicity and retro styling. Honda says the step-through chassis, clutch-free 4-speed transmission, and lightweight design 238 pounds curb weight, inspire confidence. While the air-cooled 124 cubic centimeters single delivers impressive fuel efficiency and plenty of power for zipping around town. The 2024 Super Cub has a telescopic fork with 3.9 inches of travel, twin rear shocks with 3.6 inches of travel, a 220 mm front disc brake, and a 110 mm rear drum brake. Other features include front-wheel ABS, fuel injection, and an electric starter. The humble Honda Super Cub has come a long way since its introduction back in 1958. Back then, it was designed as little more than a commuter with affordability and practicality in mind. These days, it still is practical, but at the same time, is seen as a status symbol and a lifestyle icon. Available in a myriad of colors and specifications, the Honda Cub remains a mainstay in Big Red's global lineup. Over in Thailand, Honda has released two new colorways for the Super Cub that give it even more retro flair, Pearl Organic Green and Pearl Cadet Gray. The two pearlescent colors give the Super Cub a more elegant and adventurous look, further broadening the style choices when it comes to this charming commuter. On the one hand, the Pearl Organic Green color scheme previously featured in the CT125 Hunter Cub gives the Super Cub a military-inspired look. On the other hand, the Pearl Cadet Gray is thoroughly retro, reminiscent of automotive colorways of the 50s and 60s. The Thailand Spec Honda Super Cubs are slightly different from the ones we find in Japan and the US. You could say they're truer to their origins as they make use of wire spoke wheels just like the original Cub. The models we're familiar with are equipped with alloy wheels with a diamond cut design providing a touch of modern elegance to the retro-inspired two-wheeler. Furthermore, the Tyspec Honda Super Cub is equipped with front and rear drum brakes, while other markets get the bikes equipped with a front disc brake. The two new colorways are additions to the already expansive color selections of the Honda Super Cub in Thailand. The model is also available in black, red, and white colorways, with prices starting at 48,400 baht, or approximately 1,331 US dollars. For reference, the Honda Super Cub in the US carries a retail price more than twice that at 3,899 US dollars. In terms of specifications, however, the Tyspec Super Cub shares a lot in common with the model found in other markets except for the previously mentioned drum brakes and spoked wheels. It's powered by a 109.5 cubic centimeters, air-cooled, fuel-injected, single-cylinder engine. Power is sent to the rear wheel via a four-speed gearbox. As always, the Super Cub is super approachable, with a weight of just 98 kilograms, and a low seat height of 744 millimeters. Design Styling As always, Honda's time-tested Super Cub styling, defined by the word, Universality, provides the cues for the model. 